what's going on guys? Beats here. Welcome back to another GBA emulator gameplay review. I believe this is episode 6, so we're gonna start off with the game. Obviously, if you can read titles, we are doing Star Wars Episode 3 Revenge of the Sith. Now, I'm not a big, big, big Star Wars fan, but I do like all the uh, movies. I did watch through the Clone Wars the entire way. So, you know, I, I kind of know a little bit about Star Wars. In Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith was probably my favorite Star Wars movie of them all. Not including the number 7 one, because the number 7 one was kind of bad. Anyways, guys, I'm going to review this game off the GBA emulator as usual. See how uh, graphics play an effect along with the controls and the, how the game just overall feels. So, let's get right into it. So, we're going to start off with... As you can see, I'm really new to the game. I've never really played it. Alright, so we can start a new character, and looks like we're allowed to pick who we want to pick. So I'm thinking I might go with Anakin, or I could do Obi-Wan. Yeah, I'll do Anakin, why not? And he, at this time, is still, uh, he's not a Padawan, he's actually a Jedi, so I'll keep him as a Jedi. Okay. The standard Star Wars intro. At least it's like extending, it's like going a faster. Okay, so, I mean, it's so generic because they do this for everything, all their games. They have to put, like, okay, we can just skip right by that, though. Master Obi-Wan Kenobi and Jedi Knight Anakin Skywalker set out to rescue Chancellor Palpatine, who has been taken hostage by General Grievous and his droid army. So the graphics aren't bad, though. Oh, the graphics look pretty nice. Thanks for saving my life again. Oh, it's just dialogue. I really don't care. Okay. So I get to play as Anakin who ran off to do nothing. Okay, so let's look at the controls. You got A, which to jump. B is to attack. Okay, so if you push B, a lot of times you do like a combo. And scroll, scroll down, move forward, move back. Okay, so L is to do blocks. And it looks like R is to use the force, I think. Okay, so that droid's got fucked up, yo. Okay, it's a game. Okay, this is giving us customization points. Where'd you go? Oh, let's see if I can block it. Oh! Okay, so the, the controls right now with the directional pad is kind of difficult to control. But like I said, it might just be me, so I'm not gonna do anything about it yet. But we're gonna play it a little more to see what it does. What the hell is that? Okay, so it just rejuvenates your health. And then, what the hell is this thing? Oh, so it refills my blue force thing on the bottom. One shot uppercut. The game itself looks pretty good so far. I mean, I like the graphics for it a lot. And I'm a sucker for graphics. I know, I was going to you tell him what to do. Alright, see if I can do like a jumping, plunging attack. Oh, I did! I just didn't hit him. Oh, you guys got messed up. Oh, you got messed up. Okay, so really, all you have to do is just kind of avoid. Okay, so I can do stuff like that. Okay, so more force stuff. Oh, I was trying to use the forest. I just got my health destroyed. Okay, so that was a good move. Did you see that move? That was pretty beastly. If I could, I'll put it in slow motion, because that was actually a really nice move I did. Okay. Random cutscene. Okay, so this is where it's going to use the forest. So if there's an item on the ground, I can use it to destroy enemies. That's a good thing to add in. Okay, so... This is for my fury. It's called Vader's Wrath, which kind of shows you. And I'm guessing I can use the force in this, right? I can. Okay, guys, welcome back. Sorry, I had to do a cutout really quick. But anyway, let's keep going. I don't want to go too far. Ooh, double kill. We 
are destroying everyone that comes near me. See, like I thought he was gonna kill me, when really it was the opposite. Graphics, like the controls, the thing is the directional pad is hard to play with. But all in all, the game so far is doing is pretty good. Like it's actually fun to play. Yeah, you know, I know what you guys are thinking, you're like, oh well I might do a playthrough on this. Never said that yet, I'm not I don't think I am not in this game. Unless you post in the comments that you want to see a playthrough. Like I said, it's all gonna wait until I get my boga. Cause then games like this would be a lot easier. Ooh, a lot of lag. They're trying to flank me now. Oh, I died finally, damn it. It's okay though. Get jump shotted. So my fury's built up, so I'm hoping next next time I get into a group of enemies. Huh? So what the hell is that? Dude? Oh, it's a bomber. I don't know what to do with this bomber. I'm guessing I have to use the force on something. I don't know what to do here, to be honest, guys. Oh man, I have no clue what to do with this part. Do I just keep dodging? Do I jump on it, maybe? No, I have no clue what to do, guys. Cause then I can't, I, I was thinking maybe I have to use the force to push these things, but for some reason it's not working. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. Okay, so I can't do anything. Cause he's not even close. Yeah, I got him to die. Alright guys, well, let's just let's just quit to the menu. Yeah, let's do my little uh, my little spew on the game. So all in all, the controls are kind of difficult. Uh, the directional pad is like the only thing I have a problem with. Everything else is pretty good though. Definitely be easier when you have a MOGA though. And I keep saying that because I can't wait till I get it. So anyways, other than the directional pad, the game's graphics are pretty good. I do like the combat system. And it's not too challenging. It's not like horrible. It's just, you know, you gotta, you gotta strategize a little bit. So, as in terms of ratings, I think Beats is going to rate this at about a 4 out of 5. Only because of the directional pad's weakness to fulfill to specifications of movement. So anyways guys, that's my review of the game. If you want to download it, link will be in the description below. As to all my other uh, games I review, there are links were also in their descriptions if you want to check those out. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoy. If you did, make sure to click that like button, subscribe to me on the channel, and post in the comments what other emulators you like me to play, if anyone actually posted in the comments. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm Beat, and I'll see you in the next review.